me You'll find it in the strangest place Hello and welcome back to Lifestyle and Net Worth. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at what your life is like when you're a member of one of the most popular bands in the world. What would your life look like if you were the lead vocalist of the band Westlife, Shane Fillon? Where would you live and what car would you drive? Well, in this video, we're going to be finding out how these icons live their lives. Just, I could talk to him about anything. Really? I would talk to him about the first person that would call after the Late Late Show would be my dad now Get on the way home. That was class, sir. Jeez, you look great. Shane Fillon is the lead vocalist of the band. He has a net worth of $3 million. Shane Fillon likes horse riding. He loves to play snooker. He also does a lot of charity work alongside his band. The group has supported various charitable causes. They were involved in the Helping for Haiti charity single that was released in February 2010, as well as releasing cover versions of Uptown Girl for Comic Relief, one of their biggest selling singles to date. They participated in a Royal British Legion Poppy Appeal, Irish Blood for Life 2004, and did an advertisement for Galway's Irish Water Safety Campaign. They also lent their support to the Irish Blood Transfusion Service. On November 4th, 2005, they performed with other music artists at Coca-Cola Dome in Johannesburg, South Africa for the Unite of the Stars Gala Banquet Charity Concert that supports four charities. The Nelson Mandela Children's Fund, Unite Against Hunger, St. Mary's Hospital, and the Topsy Foundation. Fillin married his childhood sweetheart, Gillian Walsh, on December 28, 2003 at Ballantubber Abbey, followed by a reception at Ashford Castle, Ireland. Gillian is the cousin of fellow band member Kean Egan, making Fillin and Egan cousins-in-law. They have three children, daughter Nicole Rose and sons Patrick Michael and Shane Peter, named after his father. Shane and Gillian were forced to sell their dream Sligo mansion, once valued at 10 million euros, for $800,000 in 2012 and relocate to the UK. However, just two years later, the family moved home and purchased a stunning new home for $780,000. Shane lives in the six-bedroom, five-bathroom home with his wife of 17 years and their three children, Nicole, Patrick, and Shane. Shane and Gillian bought their home in Ballincar near Ross's Point in 2014 for $780,000 after moving back from the UK. Shane Fillin drives a Mercedes-Benz and a Porsche. After every thought, is, it's like, oh, what will that mean to my kid? Or yeah. what will that make me as a father and mm. stuff? So it certainly does. But you know, you can't think too much about it as well. I suppose you have to sort of find a balance, really. Marcus Fahili was the lead vocalist of the band. He has a net worth of $60 million. Fahili has co-written several Westlife songs, all 15 tracks of his debut solo album and numerous unreleased songs. He announced on social media that he and Shane Filling co-wrote the new single for Amelia Sande and Ronan Keating called One of a Kind released in 2020. Fahili is interested in charity works and supports the charity group AWARE. He was shortlisted in 2011 as one of the top 50 most influential gay individuals. He congratulated his local football club 
Sligo Rovers on their victory in the 2011 FAI Cup Final. On February 22, 2019, he announced his engagement to Callian O'Neill through his Instagram account during their holiday in Hurawali in the Maldives. On October 3rd, Fahili and O'Neill announced the birth of their daughter, Layla, via surrogate. Mark Fahili lives in Lakeslide Sligo Home, generously arranged two-level ranch house complete with cowboy bath and stellar views of Loft Gill and its 16 islands, immortalized in W.B. Yeats' poem, The Lake Isle of Innisfree. Mark Fahili drives a Range Rover. Last minute, I was kind of here to help out, but you know, it's, it's great for me, having been in West Ham for so long, to go to the LG Arena again. You know, we, we were only here a year ago on our farewell tour. Nikki Byrne was the lead vocalist of the band. Nikki Byrne has a net worth of $3 million. In 2003, Byrne guest hosted an edition of CD UK with Kat Dealey. Byrne hosted the closing ceremony of the Special Olympics live from Dublin's Croke Park in front of 80,000 spectators. Throughout the years, Byrne has appeared on Children in Need and Comic Relief several times. In 2001, he co-hosted Children in Need live from Belfast, and in 2011, co-hosted a BBC Radio 2 special with Patrick Keelty for The Cause. In January 2017, Byrne started hosting an Irish version of the TV show Dancing with the Stars alongside Amanda Birham and Jennifer Zamparelli from 2019. In March 2019, Byrne left 2FM to rejoin the newly reunited Westlife. In June 2020, he hosted RTE Does Comic Relief during the COVID-19 pandemic. In October 2021, Byrne was announced as the host of the new singing competition commissioned for RTE entitled Last Singer Standing. Byrne married Georgina Ahern, whom he first met when they were about 12 years old, on August 5, 2003, at the Wicklow Register Office, Wicklow County, Wicklow. The civil ceremony was followed by a church blessing on August 9th at the Roman Catholic Church of St. Pierre at St. Paul in Gallardin, Eurit Lore, France. The couple have three children. Live the high life in our lavish coastal residence situated on Millionaire's Row, Malahide. He owns an Aston Martin. We sold 45 million albums worldwide, and um, we got to duet with some of the biggest superstars in the world, Mariah Carey, Lionel Richie, Diana Ross. Kean Egan was the backing vocalist of the band. Kean Egan has a net worth of $20 million. Egan spoke of the 2010 FIFA World Cup in South Africa, but said he would not go after the Republic of Ireland national football team was eliminated from the tournament after Theory Henry's handball. Egan was ranked number five on Ireland's sexiest men of 2014. On October 21, 2012, Egan co-presented the revamped version of Surprise, but did not return the following year. In 2013, Egan appeared on the 13th series of I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. He was ultimately crowned King of the Jungle, which contributed to an invitation to being signed by Rhino Records to create his home album. From January 5th to 9th, 2015, Egan and Angela Griffin co-hosted Fat Pets, Slimmer of the Year on ITV. Egan married English actress and Girl Thing and Wonderland member Jody Albert on May 8, 2009. Albert had given birth to a baby boy, Koa, on December 20, 2011. The 38-year-old and his actress wife have been living in the secluded spot of Strandhill in Kean's hometown of Sligo for several years. Kean Egan owns an Aston Martin. a Range Rover. A Mustang Shelby.